A new restaurant in Yuma recently reopened amid the roller coaster of precautions and guidelines brought by the CDC. And now its owners are seeing success. I, I think it doesn't hurt to try something new in Yuma. Many Arizona restaurant owners and operators continue to reopen for full service. But things are a little different now. That's a reality for the owner of a new Indian restaurant in Yuma, introducing a new type of food to the community while following CDC guidelines. Placed hand sanitizers on our table. We sanitize our tables and our boots, not just the table. Another guideline restaurants need to follow, social distancing. We just want to make sure the crowd is not together by any means. So that's the reason we also had this panels here so that it's not uh, transmitting anything like an airborne stuff. They've only been open for a couple of weeks, but they've seen the success of offering a part of their culture through their food. We can give people that have never even know what Indian food is, that spice, that different spices from Mexican spices. Dishes like tandoori chicken, garlic naan, and one of their more popular dishes. Traditionally, it's called as a butter chicken okay. or makani chicken. Makani is in the, trans in the translation, it's a... Uh, butter. Okay. So we call it as a butter chicken. They also offer vegetarian options as well. We have seven non-vegetarian options, but we have 17 non-vegetarian options. Okay. See like an enormous response from the customers. Um, they have been appreciating our food so much. Gabe Salzar, News 11.